Hi guys, welcome and welcome to my channel, Everything Good About Life. And now it's Valentine's Day, and I'm bringing you Valentine's edition video. Yeah, so today I'm going to be making a shepherd's pie. Um, the reason I've like decided to do this video today is because while we were dating, my hubby and I, on Valentine's Day we always go out. We always went out. So like we want to do something different today. Stay indoors and do everything we want, including cooking a sumptuous meal. Welcome. So my ingredients today I'll be using carrots, peas, beef, onions, garlic, uh, all-purpose flour, uh, tomato paste, salt, chili, and blue band <laughs> no it's not a promotion I just I don't have butter so I'm going to use blue band instead and we have milk and potatoes which I'm going to mash later on and then my oil so let's go guys let's start cooking so I'm supposed to use ground beef or minced meat what's the difference by the way Okay, if you know the difference between ground beef or minced meat, minced, minced meat, or if it's the same, tell us in the comment section. I was supposed to use uh, minced meat, but well, we don't really follow instructions in this channel. <laughs> but the truth is, uh, I forgot to mince my meat. Like I just bought meat na nikatoka kama kawaida. And when I was preparing for this video, I remembered that I was supposed to use minced meat, but it was too late. I'm just going to cover it and let it cook down. In the meantime, I'm going to mash my potatoes. They are just kawaida potatoes. I've just uh, boil them. I'm supposed to boil with uh, salted water but I did not so I'm going to add salt as I mash and if you're going to use blue band please add a little so a little salt because blue band is already salted and we don't want over salted food. So these potatoes might look as a match, but I did this on purpose because I want kama zita bakia, I can just have already mashed potatoes. Would you look at that? We should give a shout out to my hubby. <laughs> He's the one who cut this meat into these small pieces. Dude, I don't have I don't think I have the patience to cut them like this. Imagine. They almost look like minced meat. Okay, not anywhere close, but still. So now I'll go in with my onions. Uh, if you want it easier, you can just uh, remove all the meat from the sufuria and then you start with your vegetables, onions, and everything else on its own, and then you add the meat. But I find this easier and also less plates to wash. So I'm going to add some salt, just a little bit. Just cook until translucent. And I'm going to go in with my garlic. I minced my garlic. I'm 
and next I go in with my carrots. It smells so nice guys, it smells so nice, it smells better than it looks, <laughs> yeah. So I'm just going to cover this and reduce the heat to medium, medium low and let the vegetables cook down. And meanwhile. Let's get to let's get to our mashed potatoes. So I'll put my butter in the meal so that it will be uh, what evenly spread, if you can call it like that. Um, your mashed potatoes just cook the way you're used to cooking it. Yeah. If if you're not a fan of blue band or butter or milk, just just do you. Hey. Guys, the hunger that is disturbing me right now. I have no idea. I'm trying to make it a little runny. Uh, because when it goes to the oven, it tries to, it tends to dry up. So if you put in mashed potatoes that are already dried, then you're not going to come up with a very good meal. So try as much as possible to use at least something runny. Yeah? And I think this is just the best consistency. So we are done with that. Now let's go to our food. Would you look at that, guys? Would you look at that? Yeah. Look at that. Oh, this is going to be perfect, people. This is just going to be perfect. So what I'll do, I'll add some potato. <laughs> I'll add some tomato paste, just a bit. Uh, you'd notice that today I haven't used. You'll notice that today I haven't used a lot of spices, and it's because sometimes it's just. Well, for me, I like I like keeping simple dishes at times, but of course, garlic has to be in here. a bit of tomato paste. I think that is going to be enough. And then I'm going to add my flour. This is all purpose. And the reason we add this is so that at least stuyako itakwa majimaji. It's going to help to bind everything together and make sure that you stir the whole time for at least five seconds or something like that if you don't stir the flour is going to get stuck on your sufuria at the bottom of the sufuria that is Chakula ya leo imekubali. Valentine si Valentine. I'll just add some water. Just a little bit of water. And add my piece. These are pre-boiled. You can use frozen if you want. So 
So you can see I oiled <laughs> my casserole dish. This is because I always bake with this stuff. So with this with this dish. Now akiliangu mezoea. So when I removed it, I instinctively oiled it, but you're not supposed to. Anyways, haita leta shida, like hakuna shida. And who wants to lick this? <laughs> I'm so going to lick this off camera. So I'm going to put this in the oven for about 15 to 20 minutes in a preheated oven at 200 degrees, I think, at 200 degrees. Uh, the reason I'm using this one is because it's really full and there's a chance at Itamwakika. There's nothing I hate like cleaning an oven, so see you in <gasps> See you in 15 minutes. <laughs> 15 minutes later. This is the result, people. So I put in the oven for 20 minutes at 200 degrees. And the reason it's not so yellow, like it doesn't have a good color, is because I did not add eggs, more like an egg yolk. So if you want to have a color, you add an egg yolk in your mashed potatoes. So it's not completely cooled, that's why I cannot like cut into it and show you guys, but just look at that, look at the bubble, yeah. Also another thing you would want to do is make a proportion half and half, you will see that my meat and vegetable is so low and my mashed potatoes are a lot, it would be better if the meat was here. Anyway guys, that is it for today. I'm going to enjoy my supper with my hubby, my valentine. <laughs> so, I hope you had a great day and love yourself. Hata kama hauna mtu wakupenda, love, like, make it normal to spoil yourself so that you don't, like, wait for someone else to do it for you. Uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel to my channel and leave a thumbs up hit the like button do everything nice also guys go and check out my instagram page for business that is udis underscore clothes you will get some good stuff there thank you guys bye